Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make this slideshow in PowerPoint. So let's get into it. First, clean up the page. Zoom out to have better visuals. Add your first picture. Resize. And align it to the center. Then, select the rectangle shape and draw a rectangle, same size as the slide. We need this to not lose the boundaries of the slide. As you'll see in the next steps, parallelograms are going to cover slide's boundaries. Remove its fill and leave it with black outline. Now select parallelogram and draw a shape. Remove its outline and make it white. Increase its transparency to see through. Align it to the center. Then click on yellow dot and drag it to lower the angles. Resize it again. Copy and paste it. Also align to the center. Repeat this step two more times, so end up with four shapes. Now select from top and drag them to the left. Offset them like this. Select the guide rectangle and bring to front. Now, from left to right, set the shape's transparency to 0, 40, 60, and 80. It's time to add text. I'm going to sample headline color from the picture. To do that, select text, choose eyedropper tool and click anywhere on picture you want. Now that everything's set up, duplicate slide. In the first slide, select shapes and texts and move out of the slide. Offset them like this. Go to next slide and choose Morph Transition. Now, duplicate again. In third page, select everything but rectangle and move to right. Import second picture. Send to back. Orders of the shapes messed up. Select one on top and send backward. Then select two on top and send backward. Now set their transparencies as before, only this time from right to left. Add text.
Choose Morph Transition. As you can see, it's not perfect yet. Select the earlier text and crank up transparency. Then copy picture to previous slide and move it to left. Now send it to back. Copy text 2. Also move to left and make it 100% transparent. Delete guide rectangles. Fix shapes if there's an empty space from top or bottom. Now go to first slide and in transitions menu check the box indicates after. Leave it at zero. Note that there's no transition applied to the first slide. Now it's done. You can download this project for free and use it however you want. Link in the description. Thank you for watching. Like if you enjoyed and subscribe for more contents. See you in the next one.